The best way to defeat someone is to beat him at politeness. Do not grieve over what has passed unless it makes you work harder for what is about to come. Whosoever shows you your faults is your friend. Thoughts that pay you lip service and praise are your executioners. I have never regretted my silence, as for my speech I've regretted it many times. The less attachment to the world, the easier your life. Remind yourselves of God, for it is a cure. Do not remind yourselves of the people, for it is a disease. A man should be like a child with his wife, but if she needs him, he should act like a man. The most beloved of people to me is he that points out my flaws to me. Learn the Arabic language, it will sharpen your wisdom. Sit with those who love God, for that enlightens the mind. Go easy on yourself, for the outcome of all affairs is determined by God's decree. If something is meant to go elsewhere, it will never come your way, but if it is yours by destiny, from you it cannot flee. Sit with those who have sinned and repented for they have the softest of hearts. Learn dignity and tranquility. No amount of guilt can change the past and no amount of worrying can change the future. Sometimes the people with the worst past, create the best future. Get used to a rough life, for luxury does not last forever. My heart is at ease knowing that what was meant for me will never miss me and that what misses me was never meant for me. Patience is the healthiest ingredient of our life. To be alone you avoid bad company, but to have a true friend is better than being alone. Be dignified, honest, and truthful. When one's intention is sincere, God will suffice his needs, protect him, and guide him in his dealings with the people. Let not your love become attachment, nor your hate become destruction. To speak less is wisdom, to eat less is healthy, and to mingle less with the people is safe and serene. He who wins through fraud is no winner. The women are not a garment you wear and undress however you like. They are honored and have their rights. God loves moderation and hates extravagance and excess. He who does not live in the way of his belief starts to believe in the way he lives. Doing good for a good done to you is simply repayment, whereas doing good for an evil done to you is a tremendous virtue. Don't forget your own self while preaching to others. Acquire knowledge and teach it to people. The wisest man is he who can account for his actions. 
I wish you knew what I have in my heart for you, but there is no way for you to know except by my actions. Do not put off today's work for tomorrow. Patience is a pillar of faith. May God bless the man who says less and does more.